It's time to put this deer to work. What's going on, everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Sandy Bay here on Farming Simulator 19. Today is mowing day. We're going to pick up right where we left off yesterday. As a matter of fact, I've actually come through and done this, and I think we can make hay. And so I'm going to actually attempt to make some hay here. Uh, making a bunch is probably going to be, well, here's the thing. So we're running the new beta for the uh, DLC, and it turns out the hay and straw logos, icons, were flip-flopped. Yep, they were backwards. So now... It's actually, I thought straw was better. Hey, hey pellets are way better. <laughs> we weren't getting good money. Now we can make even better money than before. So here's what we're gonna do. We are gonna attempt to make hay. We're gonna take this field right here and we are gonna make hay. Now, if this is dry grass, if we pop this out and it's dry grass, we should be okay. And it shouldn't need any tedding. Dry grass does not need to be ted. It just needs to sit. So hopefully it'll make some hay for us. Then what we're going to do is we're going to head over here to our horse pasture. That is going to be mowed up and probably going to make some silage bales. And we're going to do the exact same thing over here at the pig farm. Also, keep in mind, we've got to harvest this stuff right here. All of our fields are ready to be harvested. So all that is going to happen today. Maybe not all of it, but most of it is going to happen today. So sit back relax oh it's dry grass let's go baby today is going to be a very interesting and fun day And we're done. That field is completely finished. Let's go ahead and raise all these guys up. Get them all folded. Raise, baby, raise. So we are done. This field completely mown. Mown? Mowed. Yep, mowed. So we're just gonna leave it, let it be, let it dry out, let it do its thing. And we've got three fields left. And you maybe say to yourself, DJ, I don't, I don't know what you're doing right now. You've got two grass fields. Well, we did. We've got another one. Money hasn't gone down. Nope. Well, how in the world do we have an extra field if the money has not gone down? Well, there is a third cow barn. That's right. There are three cow barns total on this map. You've got one on one end, one on the other, and then a third right down down here and we own it it's part of all the land that we own Ooh, slow down now, let's see here officer move along move along all right speed back up <laughs> 32 miles an hour no cop no stop no cop go speedy fast speedy fast ah, yeah. so we've got a small field now it's not huge but it's gonna be plenty big enough to where we could actually do a few things well, what do we do? Well, I think since we've got to go this way to do hay anyway, we might as well just do a hay field here since the other fields are going to be silage. Slow it down, baby. There we go. Here we are. This is Marywood Farm. Very nice. Very nice. This is where all the small cows are. All the, uh, the 
the little baby cows. This is where they are. Of course, you have full-size cows here as well, but you have your little baby cows over there. And to top it off, we have a full field. Yes, we do. If you take a look, you can see everything that we own all the way up to right over there. So why would we not mow this entire area? You may be saying to yourself, well, you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to mow this entire area right now. So let's hit it. I'm not going to go into a speedy this time. We're just going to I'm just going to mow the darn thing and be, be done with it. Let's see. Matter of fact, we could probably get closer over here if we back this in. I don't want to get too greedy, but I do want to get as close as possible. Um, this is going to be very difficult to get in with a uh, with a tether. You don't have access to this land. Well, I beg to differ, good sir. This is our land. This is my land. And I'm going to mow it. Let's go. So let's run around. Let's see. It doesn't look... Ooh, look under the map. <laughs> uh, it doesn't look like there's too much going on over here. As a matter of fact, it's it's actually pretty pretty standard. Grass all the way to the edge, right? Yeah, look at that. I think that's so cool being able to look under the map and everything. Um, I know there's some map creators that don't like that, so I'm going to refrain from doing that anymore. We are going to have to come through here. Keep this in mind. We are going to have to come through uh, once we're... Oh, we are against the side of the map. Goodness gracious. Ooh, that was a little bit tight. <laughs> uh, whenever this turns to hay, hopefully when it turns to hay, we're going to have to come through here with something to windrow this up. Now, I think that we should just go ahead and buy a windrow. We've got the money. We've got $315,000. Why would we not? So... I think that is going to be on the uh, docket of things to purchase. But I will tell you this. Coming through here, let's not go behind the water. Because I don't know what kind of uh, window we're going to get. So I don't know if we'll be able to fit back there. Um, so with this whole area right here and all this good stuff, I'm thinking... Uh, yes, we will have to plow all this up. The only problem... What are you talking about? don't have access to this oh i am all right fair fair i'm a little close here i'll back up for you how's that um yes i don't know because i know with the next update we're gonna have to redo like legit everything so i'm a little bit concerned about that so i'm trying not to plow up anything that i don't have to because it's extra work i'm gonna have to do later but if I'm going to do it later, well, I guess we might as well do it now then, huh? Let's finish this field up. We're going to finish mowing this. Then we got two more. Come on! We got two more fields to mow after this. Both of those fields are going to be done today. We're going to be making silage bills. Perfect. This is good. Also, <laughs> look at this. Look at these mowers. They're absolutely, they're just trash. Poor things. We'll have, <laughs> have to clean them up or something. Uh, I think I've got a sprayer at the other farm. We're going to be over there. We might as well clean it up whenever we're done. Plus, got a few more stops to make. So that is stop number two. That is going to be a hay field as well. Now, again, remember, the next two fields are going to be mowed and then baled and then turned into silage. We're going to do some silage bales. We're going to sell those over at the BGA, hopefully make a little bit of money. We will make more money from doing pellets let's just, let's just be completely honest with you guys we're gonna make money doing a different way but i'd much rather do two different things than just one big thing and it be boring because that's gonna be well boring and that's gonna stink i can tell you a full load's gonna get us almost 50 grand just in uh, actually a full load of our trailer a big trailer is gonna be well over fifty thousand dollars if we do that uh and we're not doing pellets or pallets right now everything that we're doing is going to be done in uh well, it's all going to be done loose there's no point in palletizing them if they're making just as much money without being in pallet form so where are we at right now so our next turn on the left we will be at our horse pasture uh oh got a police chase going on get him coppers get him he turned left <laughs> here we are number three now this and the next field should give us <laughs> If not more, we should get a good amount from these right here. These have been fertilized to the max. 
So you can take the area that we had down here, which I would say is roughly the same area as this, maybe a little bit smaller. This is going to be way, way more, way, I mean, just ridiculously. And the same thing right here, that whole thing is a grass field. This, this should be pretty good. Let's turn everybody on. Boom, boom, and go. Tell you what, if I was smart, we would use the, <laughs> these two fields right here to do the hay pellets instead of the others. You know what? We might do that, actually. We might go through and mow, uh, or re not remo. We don't have to remo anything. Everything's already been mowed good. Uh, we might go through and actually do hay pellets on these fields. Hmm. I don't know. We'll just have to see whichever one we get. I think it's probably wise to do silage bales on the two fields that we're going to have the most stuff in. And we're definitely getting the most stuff out of these next two fields. You know what? We'll just do that. We'll, we'll stick with plan A. Plan A always works. So, let's finish this field. See you guys at the, uh, remember farm? Crap, I don't even remember. I decided to go ahead and come over to our first farm that we started at, the pig farm. I decided to go ahead and come on over here and get moving because after this, we've still got a couple things more to go. We've still got to use the windrow to get everything up. We've still got to mow. Then, or mow. Yeah, we're doing that right now, aren't we? Bail. We've still got to bail. And then when we're done bailing, guess what? We're not done yet. After we bail, we've still got to wrap. So we have three more step. Three steps? Yep, three steps. Oh, well, they got to collect. Great. So we have so many more steps to go before we're done. And I just figured that you can probably didn't care too much about sitting through all that. So I decided to took a few liberties and was like, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and finish up. But it doesn't matter because we keep missing stuff, unfortunately. Look at all this crap. We keep missing stuff just right and left. This is not a mower friendly field. And I got to be honest with you, after the, <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to mow this anymore. Well, this is the only time this, is, this yard's getting mowed this year. There's no way to buy what because late autumn is the last time that you really want to mow, at least in the geo that we're using right now, which is the U.S. Midwest geo. So with that geo, usually you can get two mows out of it, but I don't know what's going on. Here in the third year, none of the grass got large enough. It didn't get tall enough. I think it's because all of the grass on the... Uh, all the I think, oh, don't know. It just didn't work. So, whatever. It is what it is. Let's finish our headlands up. Let's get out of here, birds. <laughs> we'll come through because we still have plenty of stuff to windrow up. Let's give this thing a much-needed bath. Goodness gracious. We used the heck out of this thing today. That and the fact that whenever we bought the other farm, this thing was covered in dirt. This thing was absolutely filthy. Nothing had been taken care of. It looked like, well, it looked like one of my farms, let's be completely honest here. There's that. Let's get the nice mower in the back. My question is, I don't remember what these mowers look like. Is that spot that's... Okay, it's a black. Okay. For some reason, I was thinking that the top was green. I was like, how did it get that messed up? Spray, 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 spray. Now, the question is, what mower do we... Or what mower... Of course, we have mowers already. What baler do we get? What do we use? I think I've got an idea. I think I've got a pretty good idea of everything that I want to use. And as a matter of fact, we can go ahead and buy that now. Let's go in. So we need a, so we don't need a tether, which is great, but we need a windrow. We need a baler. Hmm. Well, there's a couple options here. We can go for some of these Laylee stuff here. We can go for the Coon Merge Max, which I'm really considering. We also have the Coon GA, but we've used the Coon GA on another map. So I'm not really too interested in doing that. And we have all these over here as well. The mouse control is super, super cool. I, <laughs> DJ loves this one right here. So we might do something with this. Oh, that's Kloss too? Come on. Oh, I should have used Kloss on this map. So we've got all kinds of stuff here that we could use. But what do we use? Probably should figure that out. Also, we have balers. What do we use here? Well, I think for the balers... Since we're going to be using Kron stuff or Krona, Krona stuff later on, I think it's a good idea to go ahead and get Krone now. Not John Deere, Krone. Right here, the big pack, 4,000. 
boom, 12,000 bucks, super cheap. I think this is going to be great. We're doing square bales, so why not? Let's do a colored front. You guys like that? I like that. DJ likes this a whole lot. Here's what we've gone with. I went with the windrow that I said I wasn't going to go with, and of course, you guys saw us get the baler. No worries there. We're also going to need to get a bell ramper as well. Probably going to lease the bell ramper. I don't know why we would keep it, um, but windrow, we've got a We've got a mower, so we might as well get windrow. Tedders, um, I'm not really sure about tedders. I don't know if we ever really need tedders or not. Ooh, we just cut in front of the cop. Go, 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 go. Cut on the blinkers. Cut them all on. Cut them all on. Go, 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 go. <laughs> all right, so how many fields do we have to do this with? We need to do this to two fields. Actually, the last two fields that we mowed. So let's hit those up. One down, one to go. And oh my goodness, did I do a good job or what? Oh, I just love a good looking field like this. Yes. <laughs> There's one. Let's go hit the other one. Before I start this field, you've just got to look at it. Look, it looks like crop circles. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. All right. Let's get to work on this one. This is going to be the last field that we're going to windrow today. Everything done tomorrow. Hopefully, we'll be windrowed. Hey. We won't have to worry anymore. So let's drop it. Let's turn it on. Let's give it a little tap, tap, tap a -roo. Rock and roll, do our thing. And then it is going to be time to come through and bail. And just to be safe and just to make sure everything's all right, I'm not going to be bailing with this. We're going to be bailing with our larger uh, Massey Ferguson. That should get us through to where we need to go. Yeah, this field isn't as... Well, what would you say, pretty as the last field was? This field is a little bit more, yeah, <laughs> not as nice. Still trying to make all this stuff kind of go in with each other. See that enough? Yeah, it's a good headland. It's all over the place, but it's a, that's our, <laughs> it's a headland nonetheless. All right, time to hit the rest of this. Probably a couple of you guys may notice DJ going fast. I see it. I don't understand. How you doing that? It's a base game, baby. Let's go. Uh, this right here actually works exactly like anything else does when you fast farm. All you got to do is lower it down all the way to the ground. You don't need to turn it on. Just lower it down and then give it a little tap, tap, tap a -roo, and You'll be good to go. Almost got it through. Almost went through. We get good, though. Now we can go back and forth. All's good. Cool. Let's finish this field. Let's go pick up the baler. And now there's only one thing to do, and that is make some bales to be made, to be sold over at the BGA. Now, of course, this is going to be grass bales, so do keep that in mind. This is dry grass. There's three different kinds of grass that you're going to find in seasons, at least for base game. You're going to be finding this kind right here, which is dry grass. You're also going to be finding a uh, regular grass, wet grass, which is going to be your normal grass. Now, this, I believe, is the hay texture or something very similar to it from the base game. However, hay kind of looks like straw. It's almost straw. It's not straw, but it's almost straw. If you're ever curious, just jump out and use your Wobster. This can be found in miscellaneous. It's going to cost you 5000 bucks. You can see right there, it says grass, which means we're making grass bales. Now, of course, these are popping out bales that actually look like grass bales. These are not hay bales because, again, the game recognizes this as grass. Therefore, it is grass. That's all right with me. Again, lots of bales here, lots of things to be made. We're going to take two bales and we're going to get drowned out by the plane. Yep. Just going to farm a little bit. Let the plane go on. There we go. So, how's about this? Let's do as much as we can now. And then what I'll do is I'll kind of finish this all up off screen. We'll do um, probably all of the bell. Ooh, we missed a little bit. Don't miss too much now. Uh, we'll probably get all of the bell wrapping done off screen. And then tomorrow we will be ready to get some harvesting done and hopefully make some hay pellets as well but between now and then that is going to be it for today i hope you've enjoyed if you did make sure you drop a like on the video get subscribed to the channel join the go hand fam make sure you turn your notification bells on as well so that you never miss a daily farming simulator video here on the channel with all that being said hope you have a great day we'll see 
you later. Peace.